Namaste, friends. Welcome to Honor Your Warrior Meditation. Take a moment to settle in a comfortable seated position with a tall spine. Come to a complete yogic breath, switching the breath from automatic and unconscious to mindful, purposeful, directed by you, by your full awareness. You can give the breath image in your mind's eye. It as of smoke off of sage or steam, fog, a vapor. You can give it color, give it dimension. And as you practice this complete breath, breathing in, if possible, through the nose, slowly drawing in the breath, filling up from the low belly, through the collarbones, around the sides, and into the back body, pausing at the top, full. and exhaling with patience, with control, the right kind of control. Emptying by drawing the breath or the belly towards the spine. Just when you think you've emptied completely, pausing, and puffing out just that last few molecules of breath. Work with this here and in your everyday life when you start to feel a distance between your heart and your mind, between your body and soul. Between your truth and your actions. The breath is the foundation of our practice and that guide back to our true nature of divineness. While we know deep down and are reminded of this true nature, living in the world is a challenge. And if you are present with me in this meditation right now, if you're here to hear my voice, explore the path of yoga with me, if you woke up this morning, if you can take one breath and be here, you are a warrior. It may not always feel like it. It's natural on this human journey to go through periods of confusion, 
loneliness, loss, hurt, anxiety, depression, so much more. In this meditation, I want us to honor the warrior aspect of ourself. There is a part of your being that is keeping you in the game, that is not giving up, that is believing, bravely believing as a whisper, perhaps, but it's there below the tide of tumultuous thoughts, ravaging emotions. It's there. The warrior within doesn't always look like Wonder Woman in the movies. More often, this inner warrior appears much softer, subtle. She's honest. She is peaceful. She is fiercely compassionate. He is wise. He is wonderful. He is a part of you you can never get rid of. She's a part of you. No one can take away or break. You likely feel these words resonate deep within. And your mind likely is throwing in some doubt. That's the process. In meditation, in our practice, we strengthen that felt sense, that deep knowing. We turn the volume down on the fear and the doubt. We empower ourselves to live through the illusion. of weakness, of unworthiness. I invite you now, riding that strong, steady breath from the power of your presence and stillness right now. I invite you to open your third eye center. With your eyes closed, gazing up and in towards the midpoint of the forehead and back 
a few inches. Envisioning deep indigo blue. Stabbing into the third eye center to awaken not necessarily an image, one image of your inner warrior, but more so whatever shows up, whatever creatures, colors, shapes, scenes, landscapes, even people, heroes, mentors, contribute to the felt sense of what your inner warrior is comprised of. Shifting from that linear mind to the quantum field of thought, envisioning of creation. Things may show up that you can't relate to from your human life. Just observe. Breathe and be receptive to this deepening connection. with this honoring of the warrior within. Closing our meditation now, but staying open to what we've cultivated here and coming back to this meditation often. Your hands to heart center in Kali Mudra from prayer hands. All fingers interlace with the first fingers pointing up. simply acknowledging Goddess Kali as just one symbol of our warrior within. Om Kali, Om Kali, Om Kali, Om Ma. Om Kali, Om Kali, Om Kali, Om Ma. Om Kali, Om Kali, Om Kali, Om Ma. Om Kali Ma. Om. Namaste, warriors.